Well, guys, I just got a download about Divine Masculines. <laughs> it's real nice, it's real nice. I have chills too as I speak about it. Cause like these three cards came up as I was giving a message just now. And, and, oh man. Men, you know what I'm saying? Men, the real ones. Boss Zeddies. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Oh, I know you know what I mean. So this world's about to be completely overhauled, honey, by a real boss. Collectively, the divine masculines rising up in every single person. Men and women. It's not, it's, it's an energy. It's not a gender. So when I say Boss Zeddy, definitely a woman could be a Boss Zeddy. Okay, you'll just know. You'll just know. You'll be like, who's that bitch? Call me. There is such a change happening for the collective right now. Like, it is so powerful. You can't, you can't deny it. No one can. No one can deny it. So the message I got for the divine masculines rising up on the planet is, oh, whoa, the authority though. Like, where'd you get that? Where'd you get that? Where'd you get that energy? Where'd you get that, that opinion? Where'd you get that badassery? Like, where'd you get that though? asking for a friend like are you single uh, call me somebody here your masculine is like stepping up and it's it's it looks real good i heard the name chris i heard it's not arrogance two of swords in reverse it's not arrogance i've made a decision on something two of wands in reverse i've made a decision to stop giving to people who are not giving to me that's what i heard king of pentacles in reverse temperance um, let's see. I heard whatever floats your boat. This person, seven of swords. This person, is, okay, all right, the divine masculine and the collective right now is so cool with leaving behind people who are like projecting onto them. Because like the, the message I channeled was like, if I use the word fuck and people don't like it, I don't give a fuck, right? Oh, it's not godly. That's not a high priestess thing to do. Um, But I say it is though. I claim to be a high priestess. I claim to work with God. I claim my life, my rules, my channel, my voice, my cards, my message, my my viewers. If they if they wanted to unsubscribe, they'd do so. If they didn't like it, they would leave. Right? So so I'm here for the real ones. I'm here for the people who I mean, they get it. They're like, it's just a word, bro. Exactly. The divine masculines all throughout the world right now are starting to see that like, I'm walking away from people who project shit onto me. Like this is such a projection, Seven of Swords, such a projection. Like they're actually starting to notice that really, really what you say to me is really how you feel about you. And that is the, uh, that's the definition of projection. I mean, it is, but it's like, it's more obvious than it's ever been. It's almost like you're telling me exactly who you are by accusing me of something or by looking at me differently. You're literally telling me who you are. Wow, divine masculines, all right. Again, king of pentacles in reverse. Something about this, I'm getting, this is a friend. I heard it, it's a masculine friend of this divine masculine. Listen, could be an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. It doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, but there are energies coming at the divine masculine collective right now. And it's, whoa. It's a judgment. It's a judgment. Um, it's judgment. It's, uh, it's, it's literally a projection. Um, but the reason that this man is jealous of you is because the divine keeps blessing your bank account and you don't have to do anything hard for it. It's like, it's like you get to have an easy life, financially especially, very abundant, empress energy. Like you are in tune with your divine feminine within yourself which is why you get to be blessed, blessed, blessed. The divine feminine energy is a receiver. Like it receives, receive, 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 receive. Thank you so much for that. Thank you so much. Have a good day. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank it. Constant. And this king of pentacles in reverse is falling by the wayside. And this masculine, whoever I'm reading for right now, your divine masculine, your divine counterpart, or you viewer, you're starting to realize this person next to you Oh man, they're jealous of your money. They're jealous of the way that you can build an empire for yourself and not have to try, not have to do much. They're jealous of you. Absolutely, absolutely. And I'm hearing them throw, they're throwing shade. Nine of cups, they're absolutely not happy with you. Like they are not happy that you get to be happy. 
being free, doing whatever you want. Again, because a subconscious blockage this one has, a subconscious belief, I mean, there's an unwritten rule in this person's life that money is hard to come by. That's just not this divine masculine's reality. They have told themselves day in, day out, money is easy. I love money. Money loves me. I'm so abundant. I can get money anytime I want. It's amazing. It's like, <sighs> all right, what am I getting here for this masculine? You soon are gonna be faced with the truth that you need to stop speaking to this person around you, to my masculine, I'm telling you. Judgment and justice, yeah, you're gonna to need to stop. I think you can feel not only projections coming at you from this person, but I think telepathically, you're recognizing they send you a whole lot. Wow, they send you a whole lot of like, mm words words like garbage words garbage they send you a lot of toxic garbage trash trash thoughts you're around this person and they're giving you trash thoughts you are who you hang out with yeah i heard i just heard my spirit team say when's the last time you were able to joke around with this guy yeah seven of pentacles in reverse is negative nancy this is so woe is me bah humbug Eeyore, yeah? And look, look at this Seven of Cups. This is like telepathy. I don't know, this is th this person putting subconscious fears in you and like, you're gonna have to make a decision soon. Yeah, cause the spirit, ooh, Queen of Wands, Page of because you have somebody new coming in. You have somebody new coming into your life, Divine Masculine, and this person, man or woman, is going to be a blessing for you. And it's going to be um, handed to you by the Divine. I heard there's a lot of great opportunities. There's a lot of, of mutual understandings with you and this person. And you're going to really need to keep a fertile mind, like a very um, pristine subconscious, Yeah. Three of Cups. So this third party is going to need to get the boot. Look at this judgment again. They're going to need to get the boot. You're going to need to make a judgment call on this third party, on this friend, Divine Masculine, because it's like, it's over. All right, it's over, and you know it is. The Empress, you are your Divine Feminine. You are your perfect match. You are your own perfect match. Why am I saying it like that? Hierophant. You don't need someone external of you, and I think you're realizing this. You don't need anyone external. You are the empress. Again, the, the, both the provider, the emperor, and the receiver. The bride and the groom. The, the feminine and the masculine. You're both. You're both. You are both. You're the hierophant. So, somebody's getting the boot. Or the stiletto. Honey, if the shoe fits. <laughs> oh, that's fun. That shit was funny, actually. Look, I love being funny. I love being funny. And you know, I love, I love a very funny divine masculine, right? You know what an empress like me can't stand? A really hilarious divine masculine silencing himself or herself because some hater in the midst here cannot stand you being funny and loud and happy and getting everything handed to you just by literally breathing. Like there is such a distorted, toxic, masculine energy around this emperor and you need to know it. You need to know it, all right? What's gonna be the blessing soon for this viewer? Heard moving on up, moving on up. Ooh, six of wands. I heard moving on up in pay grade in um, 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 tax. I heard tax bracket. Moving on up, six of wands. Some of you are gonna be known for something soon. That's public notoriety here, six of wands. You're gonna be known for something. I heard you're gonna be known for kicking Tiny Tib to the curb. That's what I heard. Oh my God, Judgment 3, that's again. I literally heard it, babe. I literally heard it. I heard you're gonna be kicking Tiny Tim to the curb. Making a judgment call on this friend group, on this friend particularly, this frenemy, I guess. You're gonna be known for like saying something to this person soon. I think you're calling them out for their lack mindset or something. I mean, it's obviously not their fault. 
lack mindset. Guys, it's not anybody's fault, but you will be making a public service announcement about the fact that like, that's you, that's not me. Like, you think money's hard, not me. You think love is hard, not me. You think life is hard, not me. You think life sucks, not me. You, that's you, that's fine, but that's you. And you're gonna be very much known for this very soon, divine, divine emperor, shit. All right, all right. Divine maps, yeah, girl, the sun, the tower. It is so freaking time. You're about to call somebody out. I'm telling you, in a community, you are about to call somebody out, divine masculine, sun, masculine, tower, a shock to the system. Look at this. You are literally telling someone, look, that's you though. That's such a projection. Even if I heard they're gonna deny it, this person will be like, that's not a projection. That's really true. Okay, okay, cool, bye. Like you're going to still differentiate. The you're going to know you're right and they're wrong. Yeah. Even if other people don't agree, it doesn't matter. It, you're not even broken hearted. Three of swords, you're not broken hearted by this anymore. What gift is coming in for this masculine? Looking good. I heard a lot of people are going to be looking, checking you out. That's what I heard, Casanova. Wow, Knight of Cups. I saw the Knight of Cups, but I almost said King of Cups. Something about you feel like this, but other people see you as the king. You might feel like a knight, but that's just temporary, okay? Again, I'm getting this because there's been a masculine around you who has belittled you, demeaned, demeaning. They're very demeaning. They're very cutthroat and mean. Crass. So I'm out. The way that people view you is far different than you view you right now, okay? So the gift coming in is like a lot of eyes and attention on the Divine Masculine soon. <laughs> Close man. <laughs> oh, my oh my God, King of Wands. Like, all right, all right. So even if, whatever, like people are gonna say what they're gonna say. Like you've never burped before. You're, okay, the gift coming for the Divine Masculine. You're just gonna feel such a state of peace. Like there's so much Zen around you. Like you're just, even if they disagree, you're like, okay, disagree, bye. Like, bye. Like it doesn't even matter to you that they disagree anymore. Five of Cups, They're, they are more sad than, than you are that this friendship's ending, of course, duh. Of course, I heard because you're the truth teller. Masculine, you're the truth teller and you know it, Emperor. You know it, you're the truth teller. And you're, you're, you're not letting anybody get away with this anymore. Yeah, I heard that's your belief, not mine. Magician, I'm getting projections here. This person used to send you projections. You're sending that back. By simply, acknowledge, simply acknowledging that it's happening, you're sending all of this projection, the spiritual warfare back. I mean, you don't even have to know about magic. You don't even have to know about energy warfare. You just have to say out loud. That's you though. And actually, you don't even have to say it out loud. That's such a limiting belief. You can say it in your head, bro. Say whatever you want up here. It's your own noggin. Plant your own seeds up here. Stop listening to this person. This is a traitor. Your homeboy's a traitor, all right? Hierophant, Wheel of Fortune, wow. And I'm hearing like very soon, look at this magician again. Very soon, Divine Masculine, your fate is gonna change and that people are gonna really trust you to speak on things. And like, you know what I, what I heard is like, you're very humble. You, you have a very, you have, you're, 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 you're humble, but you're not a pushover. You have humility, but you're not a doormat. Mm -hmm. People like this about you. People like this about, just be, just be authentic. <laughs> I literally just heard something really funny in my head. Oh my gosh. Listen. Wait, guys. Okay, I'm not gonna say that because that's inappropriate, but something about what we're doing as, as, as spiritual leaders right now in the community, you're, you're being known. You're being known for like not taking projections anymore. And be just very authentic. Being like, okay, look, am I godly? 
I don't know, you tell me. Do you think I work for the devil or do you think I work for God? Like, like, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm going to do what I'm going to do. There's something very refreshing about the way you're going to lead soon to find masculine. It's like, just be authentic. Just be like, hey, I don't know the answer to your question. I don't know everything. I know that's a projection and you, you're blowing smoke up my ass, but I don't, I don't know anything else. Speak on what you know. And you're going to be blessed very soon. Yeah. You're so funny. I think somebody's coming in very soon to tell the divine masculines how funny they are. Like really, really funny. Like this, oh, I saw the Empress and the Emperor. Could be your divine masculine or feminine. Like look guys, could be your, your divine counterpart coming in. They're like, I, I heard somebody say like, I know your sense of humor. I know your, it's fucking hilarious, bruh. What you just said is so funny. The real ones are gonna laugh with you, not at you. Ooh. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah. This is great. This is such a beautiful message. Let's see. Anything else, Holy Spirit, for the Divine Masculine Collective? I heard the name Tony. I heard. I heard uh, Tony's reaching out. I heard that. I don't know. Ten of Pentacles on the floor. Ooh, Four of Wands. Yeah, I heard, I heard if this man is jealous of you now, Divine Masculine, just imagine how jealous they're going to be when you're in union and when you have money pouring in like from five or six revenue sources. Oh my God. Oh my God, bro. Because do you know how freaking wealthy you'll be in Divine Union? Like, oh my God. Can't make it up. This card actually fell on the floor in this deck, from this deck. And here it is on the do you know how upset? There it is, Ace of Swords. This man is so mad, or woman. I think it's I think it's a man, really. They're so upset that even though you fumbled the ball and you fumbled the bag, like you lost money. That you're somehow just all of a sudden speaking positivity and speaking prosperity over your life again and you get it again, just like that. The more you say that's your belief, you think money is hard. Money's not hard. We're supposed to be loving our life. We're supposed to be living an easy life. That is your belief. Fucking have a seat, figure it out, and stop projecting that shit out of me. Because I don't think that it's hard. I think life is easy. I think we're supposed to be in love, rich, healthy, living an easy life every single second of the day. That's what I believe. So the more the masculine is telling this distorted friend, friend of me, okay? Like, that's your money problems. Your money woes are not my money woes. The more you see the differentiation between you and them, the more your wallet starts to get fatter, okay? You gotta love it. And the more that you come into union with your divine feminine, which, of course, will help your bag improve a lot, too. Mm-hmm. And I heard moving on up. Three of wands. Yeah, it's gonna happen very speedily, very quickly. Moving on up. Moving on up the ranks, guys, eat the pence. This is cute. I'm gonna leave it here, I love you, I love you.